Northwestern has been an incredibly supportive community for me as a graduate student. I came in having never coded before, so they were very supportive about, like, don't let that stop you. And so I decided to go back for my PhD and found Northwestern as this really cool program between psychology and understanding people and behavior, but also with computer science. And so it was a perfect kind of program to go back and actually get to learn how those two worlds could intersect. The Delta Lab is a interdisciplinary lab that is housing a number of different PhD students from different departments. So there are a number of us that are from this technology and social behavior TSB program, but then there are students that are from learning science, there are students that are from computer science, there are students that are more design. The Delta Lab was formed on the premise that innovation happens at the intersections. And when we have different people from different domains connecting together, talking about ideas, great breakthrough ideas happen. Delta Lab solves problems for a lot of different populations. A lot of our research is around helping support undergrads in their learning. Um, as an undergrad, I discovered Delta Lab um, pretty early on, and it was the first time where I was really exposed to a community of researchers that um, had female PhD students and female faculty. To see female role models um, like Liz Gerber, like Emily Harper, there were just so many people that I could look up to. In a wonderful way, our advisors in the Delta Lab have been really powerful examples of building up their own projects. I think seeing that kind of entrepreneurial community in the lab really helped me realize that I don't want my research to just be a paper. I really want it to be something that's out in the world. So the Delta Lab supports student projects like Brave Initiatives by encouraging them to apply their research into the, into the world, make an impact.